Hi, my name is Victor Bavine, and I am the author and narrator of Certainty. Certainty is based on a true story of an actual event that happened in Newport, Rhode Island uh, at the end of World War I. And uh, Newport was, um, as, as you may know, was a, is the, the playground of the, of the super rich and was at that time. And there was also a very well-established naval training base there. There was um, some implication of some little, little bit of loose sexuality going on there. So the Navy decided they wanted to put a stop to it. So they um, organized an undercover operation where they recruited um, 25 uh, young sailors to go undercover into the local gay community in order to entrap them. There were 17 sailors who were arrested. Then they started going after civilians and they uh, arrested this very prominent minister in the Newport community. It was a, a huge scandal in the town, and then when he went to trial, it became a national scandal. So the story basically follows the, the, the trial of the minister and the lawyer who defends him, and then you get to know five of the undercover sailors. William Bartlett is a 35-year-old um, uh, uh, young lawyer, son of a lawyer, and he sees this the, the defending the minister as being a great opportunity to really stand up for what he believes in. He's a man, you know, just trying to make sense of the world, um, like, like so many of us are, and um, thinks he knows what's, what's, uh, what's right in the beginning and, and, and certainly has a lot of his, um, a lot of his uh, um, suppositions challenged during the course of the story. Twenty years ago is when I first discovered the story I was walking down Lower Broadway, it started to rain it was one night and I ducked into a bookstore and picked up this book of historical essays and I saw this and I said, oh my God, I have to do this as a novel. And, um, and having spoken 20 books aloud for a year, it, just, I, it was just in my bones. I knew, I could feel it. I could feel when it was right and when it wasn't. The characters became so compelling to me. Each of them came to this event, this trial. Um, thinking they absolutely knew what was appropriate, what was inappropriate behavior for men, but in general, morality, their, their morality was clear, but totally diametrically opposed to the other. I would say I identify with the four main male characters in the story. They're all sort of aspects of me battling against each other to figure out where the truth really lies, what gray area the truth lies in. Uh, William, the part of William that I identify with is um, uh, I can be a bit of a control freak, and he certainly is that, you know, and he, he, he really wants to know what's right and what's wrong, and he wants to stand up for what's right. 